I now call to order this meeting of the Anchorage Assembly. It is Tuesday, February 7, 2023. Thank you. Mr. Mayor, you didn't address the recent letter we all received from the former Human Resources Director, Nikki Shabaka. Um, of particular concern in that letter, and what I wanted to ask you about was he um, indicates that there was only a one-day vetting um, given to, of time given to him with regard to uh, Joe Gerace. And I guess my question is, um, when we were taking up Mr. Drace's confirmation, I twice delayed that item um, and asked for an executive session. So what, if any, additional vetting did you request in response to the concerns that were being raised with regard to Mr. Drace? Thank you. Uh, through the chair, uh, Ms. Zautel, I will defer to uh, municipal attorney, acting municipal attorney, uh, Blair Christensen, as that is an HR and legal issue. Thank you. Actually, I am not asking Ms. Christensen. I'm asking what you may have asked for because I don't believe it's an HR issue as to the process you've used um, or a legal issue. Um, whether or not you asked for additional vetting or actually only asked for a one-day turnaround is a factual issue. Uh, as it addresses uh, a former employee and current employees in that process, uh, through the chair, by the way, um, that is an HR issue, um, and I think you should know that. I know you feel differently, but the facts are the facts, and this is an HR issue. All right. Well, thanks for the opportunity to ask the question, Madam Chair, but apparently I'm not going to get a response. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Zalatel. Mr. Perez Verdia. Thank you, Madam Chair. I, I, um, I guess I want to give you an opportunity, Mr. Mayor, to address you know, what most of us in the community have been reading and hearing about your administration, the massive amounts of resignations, the toxic work environment. Um, and so I'd, I'd, like, I'd like to give you an opportunity to, to re respond to, to those, not the HR issues, but the issues of the fact that your administration is crumbling. And, I, and I'd like to, to hear from you as to, as to what's going on and what you're doing about it. That's the first question. The second question is, have you seriously considered resigning? Uh, through the chair, I have not uh, considered resigning in any way, in any, uh, in, in any fashion whatsoever. Um, as to the issues that we are, you are reading about in the media, uh, we are, I think, prepared to have a work session on that, if you are prepared for that. Um, and uh, but again, we're not going to talk ab about this matter, these HR matters, um, in, the, in a public forum. Um, past, present, and future employees need to be confident that, um, that their issues, their personnel issues, are not going to be spoke about in public. And that's why I've remained silent. And I've said that over and over, and I've told the assembly that, and the media that, and we're going to stick with that. Thank you. Um, this is just such a farce. If you were to see, and someday you will, what they don't want to show you, it has absolutely nothing in it, and that's why they don't want you to see it, because they want you to think they were doing more than they were, which was nothing. No investigation, basically. So it's embarrassing. It's a waste of time. Um, but here we are, yet again, wasting our time with this mayor. Thank you. We get to executive session. We get nothing absolutely nothing. The municipality, the mayor's administration is on fire. It's burning. We get nothing. We were promised an investigation. The community was promised an investigation, and we have received nothing. And to say the least, it's very, very upsetting. This is a very serious situation. And forgive me, yes, I'm very upset. My husband and I decided to make Anchorage our home. We decided to raise our children here. And to see it being handled like this is so incredibly painful and so unnecessary. And yes, I am upset. Forgive me, folks. But this is really hard to take, Mr. Mayor. And I don't understand your behavior. It's like you don't give a hoot about our community. So I think it's time that you address us all and tell us what the heck is going on with your administration. Thank you, Madam Chair. Thank you, Ms. LaFrance. Mr. Mayor. 
Thank you, Madam Chair. I appreciate the opportunity. Um, I understand uh, your emotion. At the end of the day, you need to understand this is a legal issue. The people that need to answer this are over here. I, I could order all the documents, whatever, and the, it, the law department will still refuse. I can order them uh, released. It makes no difference. I don't know. We've been dealing with some of these issues Blair has for over a year, and it's, the answer is always going to be the same, is, is always going to be the same, in that this is a legal issue. I don't know how you don't understand that, but uh, I just thought I needed to be on the record to summarize what Blair has been saying for a year. So thank you.